please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Good morning and welcome to the 85th edition of Wake Up Tacoma. Today is Friday, January 18th. Attention TPMS students, if you are interested in entering the Montgomery County Science Fair, you must submit forms to Mr. Gehring in room 210 on or before January 25th. No forms will be accepted after January 25th. Students who will be participating in the Welton High School Engineering Program and needing transportation should report to Mr. Gehring's room at the end of the day. And now, and now a special report from Mr. Wilson. Good morning, Tacoma Park. This is Mr. Wilson. I have got two things I needed to announce. One is that um, the Washington Capitals are still the Stanley Cup champions. Um, that's very important to know. The second is, um, last week I was uh, doing some cleaning up in the TV studio, and I came across, the I, th I think, one of the very first student-made productions um, ever done in Tacoma Park uh, Middle School. And as some of you know, this is a pretty old uh, middle school. It's been around for a long time. This building is fairly new, but uh, before that, there was another building here. So this school at Tacoma Park building, uh, building is, and the school has been around for a very, very long time. And I came across one of the oldest productions um, that I think I've ever seen. And so I thought it would be fun to play it um, because it's uh, it's so old that it's actually it's uh, one of those silent type um, productions. Uh, they didn't have audio back then. So I thought it would be fun to play it today. So without further ado, The Knicker Conundrum.
this just in. Sixth graders, please remember to get your outdoor ed packets signed this weekend. Bring them by, bring them by next Friday to get a buddy sheet to request cabin mates. The boys basketball team won a thriller at home last night versus rival Easter, 32 to 29. After trailing by three at halftime, the boys outscored Eastern 10 to zero in the third quarter to take the lead, and they never looked back. Ellie Green, Green Berger led the way in scoring, putting in 10 points, followed by Greg Lomax and, and Haki Hamid, each adding seven. The boys' close victory improved their record to 4-0. to The next game is Tuesday, January 29th, at home versus White Oak. And now our Mindfulness Minute. Remember to clear your mind and relax.